I have just wrapped up my personal and professional growth time here in the Next Level Studio. And what this is is something that I've done recently. Uh, it, it's something I've recommitted to, but it's a, a new commitment for 2018. And that is I'm dedicating a minimum of 30 minutes all the way up to two hours per day, a minimum of five days per week in 2018 to my personal and professional growth. And what I'm doing with this 30 minutes to two hours on a regular basis is I'm taking in new insights, new materials that are going to help me grow personally and professionally. A lot of these materials are from folks like Tony Robbins, Jim Rohn, Earl Nightingale, Napoleon Hill, um, just a lot of people who have written materials that are time-tested success principles in the area of personal and professional development. And I figured in today's vlog post, I'll just share with you just some of the random things that are just going through my mind because I have so much that is going through my mind right now. Uh, currently, I'm thinking about the word decision. Now, this is a word that I've just picked up and have been using throughout my entire lifetime without really knowing what the word decision actually means as far as its root, um, where it came from. So, um, yeah, I mean, I, obviously you, you have multiple different options and then you make a decision and you go in a certain direction, right? So I, I, I get that. That was my understanding of the word decision. But I was listening to the audiobook for Awake the Giant Within from Tony Robbins. And in that audiobook, just in passing, he mentioned the root Latin meaning of the word decide, which uh, comes from the word sid or cis from Latin, which means to cut off from. And the actual rest of the word, if you look at it, the word decision literally means to cut yourself off from all other possibilities, or to cut yourself off from all other options. And this goes along with so many different things that I've read over the years in, in personal development and professional development when it says to get focused on one thing, to stop multitasking. And what a freeing thing to think of the power of a decision when it's not just making a decision of a couple different things that are, you know, I. It, many times I thought of decisions of, okay, here are 15 different, or here's an unlimited number of options. Now I'm going to make a decision, and here are the three things I could choose. That I'm deciding that these are the, the, one, the three things. But really, the power of the word decide is to choose one thing and cut your, yourself off from all other opportunities, or all other options, I should say. I, 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 okay, I think there's so much more to it than this, but... What I've been thinking about is, for example, when you have a dream or a goal or a desire, something you want to achieve in life, you can make decisions to make that become a reality in an instant. This isn't something that over time I can begin to apply this. You have to actually come to a place where you decide to cut yourself off from all other possibilities. And it makes me think about the time when I decided in November 2014 that I was going to work out six days a week, every week for the rest of my life. And that, in the truest definition of the word decision, was one of the most powerful decisions I've made in my life. I clearly even without understanding the root definition of the word decide or decision, I clearly, when I made that decision, I cut myself off in my mind and heart and soul and everywhere else that counts that there is no other option. There is no other possibility for my future other than the future of me, Cliff Ravenscraft, the guy who now works out six days a week, every week for the rest of my life. And then when I think about some of the other things that I have achieved, some of the goals that I've set out to uh, go after and, and then have achieved, it, it, it is literally in that moment of decision when I finally got so serious about what it is I wanted to do that I cut myself off 
in my heart, my mind, my soul, and every part of my being from any other possibility. And I said, this is, I'm going to achieve this. I don't yet know how I'm going to achieve this maybe, but I'm going to decide right now and I'm going to take an immediate action and whatever that action uh, provides as far as results, I will then evaluate the results that I get and if I don't like the results from that action, well, that's no problem. I'm not going to go back. There is, I have been cut off from all other possibilities other than the achievement of what I said I decided to do. And so therefore, I will take a new action. And I will see what kind of results I get from that action. And if I don't get it from that from that action, the results don't give me what I want, then I'm going to continue over and over and over and over again doing new actions, taking new actions on a consistent basis until I finally realize my goal. I achieve it. And it's just the power of the word decide, decision. And here we are at the beginning of, beginning of a new year, 2018, and I just wanted to share that with you in my vlog today. I the, the word decision. Have you made a decision recently? Are you facing some options, some things that you know you want to accomplish, things that you know you want to do? The next time you think that you've really made a decision, the, I want you to evaluate, am I really deciding this? Or am I just desiring this? Am I just wanting this? I want to encourage you to make a decision today, one that you know that you need to make. There, I, I'm speaking to some of you. I know there's a decision, something that you need to accomplish that needs to be a part of your life or something that needs to maybe be eliminated or removed from your life. But there's a decision somewhere that you need to make. And when you actually decide what you are doing is you are going to cut yourself off from any other possibility. That's what I encourage you to do today. Make a decision. Until next time, I encourage you to take everything you do to the next level.